the first inkling I had that uh, I was possibly, could be connected to this movie at all was that I got a call from Alan and uh, Howard. I didn't know them, but they called, uh, came through the agency. <laughs> and uh, they said, they told me why they were calling me. They said, we, we have an idea. Uh, Disney is going to make a movie of uh, this lovely story, this fairy story. And uh, there's a part of, 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 of a little woman, uh, Mrs. Potts. I said, Mrs. Potts. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, is, is she, oh, she's a teapot. I said, oh. <laughs> well, I'm glad you clarified that. And they said... <laughs> And we wondered if you would be interested. We'd like to play you uh, our recording of the song that you would sing as Mrs. Potts. So uh, I listened to it, and it was, uh, it was tale as old as time, yes. But they sang it kind of rock style. They <laughs> said, tale as old as time, <laughs> you know. And I thought, Cockney, uh, you know, teapot singing that style. <laughs> I said, well, uh, if... If you'll just let me have it, let, send me the music, let me record my, what I think might be a, 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 a more realistic version of a teapot <laughs> singing this song. <laughs> so they said, Well, you have me. more experience with teapots. I oh, think. a lot of experience. I've got the biggest collection of teapots you'll ever see. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> During the period when the movie was coming out, everybody sent me a teapot. <laughs> <laughs> Need I say more? And of course, there were some lovely ones with uh, frilly hats and everything for the tops, <laughs> and uh, they're all uh, all around the place. Anyway, uh, I, I really took it very seriously. I thought, oh, how exciting to be in a great Disney movie like this, and this is a wonderful story. So I I did my version of what I felt it should be, and uh, I'm happy to say that they grabbed it hook, nail, and sinker, and that was it. That, uh, my version became the, the version. <laughs> <laughs> I had a lot of fun putting the lady together because I had known a little woman who was, uh, had, had been a cook uh, when I was a little girl, and her name was Beatty. And she was, uh, Beatrice was her name. But she had this wonderful kind of warm accent and way of talking, you know, like this, a real cockney. And I, I just absorbed all those sounds when I was a kid, and uh, I've used them all mm. <laughs> throughout my career, one way or another. And uh, I thought, it's Beatty. That's who I'm going to go for. And I had a wonderful time putting together. And, of course, it was written so magnificently by the writers and... and of course, the animation was so extraordinary and wonderful, but it all worked, thank God. It all came together, melded together, and uh, Mrs. Potts became one of the most important characters that I ever portrayed <laughs> in motion pictures. Oh. I think she's been a little uh, shy here. Don, would you tell the rest of the story of her recording session? Uh, well, Angela, As the producer, <laughs> I think you probably remember very well. Yeah, I remember you flying out with your dear husband to New York, where we recorded this song. That's right. And your flight was delayed yeah. and had to land in Las Vegas uh, because there was a bomb scare on the plane. That's right. And you had to change planes. And I found out about it, and I said, well, that's fine. We'll move off till tomorrow. And I got word from you that was like, no, 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 I'll be there. And just hold the orchestra. So we waited. <laughs> we held the orchestra. And you had landed. And then you said, yes, I'll still come in. I said, you don't have to come in. We'll do it tomorrow. It'll be fine. No, I'm still coming. <laughs> Elevator doors opened. You came in. The orchestra was still there. We tuned. You stepped into the booth and sang the song. And that's the song that's in the movie. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so... Thank you for remembering that. <laughs> it's, uh, impressive, impressive. I was so awed to, to, to sing with the New York Philharmonic. I nearly died. You know? yeah. <laughs> so I had to get it right. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and you did, yeah. <laughs> yes. uh, in a sense, I think your character is kind of the maternal sense of the, or uh, sensibility of the picture. 
Uh, oh yes, yes, she's she's in love with love, and 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 watching these two, it's just she's absolutely love being part of it, and she's going to, you know, she's going to blend in, and she's going to help them. She's <laughs> going to be the, the person that's going to get them together, you know. And this, she's mad about the idea, and uh, of course she succeeds. Oh, part of it. <laughs>